I am a modern day Medusa apologist, but I'm gonna rein it in today so that we can talk about the Eleusis Amphora. The Eleusis Amphora is a big amphora that dates to around 670 to 650 BC, found in Eleusis. Oh my god, no way. And it depicts some of the earliest known images of Greek myth upon it. On the neck, we have Polyphemus being blinded by Odysseus. On the shoulder, there's some sort of animal fight. And on the body of it, there's Medusa being beheaded by Perseus and him running away from her sisters. Big monster slaying energy here and ties back to Poseidon if you think about it deep enough. It was painted by someone known as the Polyphemus Painter because this is their only accredited work and because Polyphemus is on it, they've decided to call him the Polyphemus Painter. It's as simple as that. Most likely due to its size and elaborate decoration, probably a funerary marker. But there was an unintentional burial put inside it. It was broken in half so that the remains of a little boy could be put inside and then it was all stuck back together again. Which is a wee shame. But it's a lovely pot though. 